Turned the corner. Inside! LeBron. Lance. Lance. LeBron. LeBron. Lance. LeBron. Lance. Lance. LeBron. Lance. LeBron. Lance. LeBron. What is going on, YouTube? It's your boy, the W, the I, the Z, the I, the E, dash 33. I am not excited about this NBA season coming up, man. This is... Man, if I... Listen. I don't know what the hell is going on. Um, Golden State, you are now officially uh, just a team full of pansies. I am not a Golden State hater. You know what's funny? I actually enjoyed the Golden State this past year. Because they really worked their ass off to get that championship as far as uh, Houston goes. But, of course, the finals, we know what that was. I don't have any respect for the NBA right now for allowing this, this DeMarcus Cousins thing to happen. Um, if he's any, in any way, shape, or form, as good as he was last year, it's a wrap. Now, LeBron going to the Lakers. Let's, let's, let's discuss that. We're not even going to talk about the, the, the nonsense. We're going to talk about Golden State in, a, in, in another video. All right, we're going we gonna to definitely get on their ass. But um, LeBron James going to the Lakers. He is going to the Lakers with Lance Stevenson, folks. Oh, my damn. Now... Are you excited about it or are you uh, a little bit off put? Because I think that this this signage is going to is going to and Rondo. Oh, excuse me. So we got two head head cases. So we got two head cases. We got Rajon Rondo, a point guard that LeBron needed. Now LeBron can go to that scoring mode. And now we'll see who wins MVP because obviously MVP is more more so about scoring. So we're definitely going to see that. As far as Rajon Rondo going, um, I like that those two matching up because they're, they're two tough competitors. They respect the hell out of one another. I mean, they never really had any issues besides the Boston days. So, I mean, the Boston days was just, uh, you know, it's, you got you to gotta fight the win, right? But as far as Lance and LeBron, this is going to be a real interesting matchup. And to see who is going to give that oomph, you know what I'm saying? Because now... LeBron has no one to really bother him anymore in the NBA now. It's like there's no real stickler out there but Lance that was on LeBron. But it never affected LeBron. You know, still dropping 40. Didn't matter. Now, I'm not a LeBron James super fan like everybody else. You know, most people. I am a fan, but I am not no super fan, guys. So, understand that first and foremost. So, don't think I'm talking on, be on LeBron's behalf. I am not at all. All right. I do want to, though, go into who they should have picked up if they can get Kawhi Leonard in a trade somehow it will be I think that's why they're bringing in Rajon Rondo and they're bringing in Lance because they're going to trade out their year two players I think Lonzo Ball is on his way out of here um, I think a couple other people are on their way out of here and it would be good for them you know what I'm saying to grow somewhere else because Lakers is not some place you want to grow you got to be somebody already to be in the Lakers you know what I'm saying and Lonzo Ball wasn't that that dude in college you know what I'm saying he wasn't that kind of guy to take all the stardom so I don't know what LeVar always talks about but he wasn't that type of guy he's a good player don't get me wrong but he's not that type of guy now LeBron going to Lakers uh, and uh, Lance and I think they're going to make the move for Kawhi and another big man. The big man, though, if they can get somebody just in general, somebody that that's concrete, like a like I would like to see a DeAndre Jordan there. You know what I'm saying? Nobody, no superstar in person, but just a small DeAndre Jordan. Now, this is going to be a bully team. This is going to be a team that's going to get away with a lot of calls, going to do a lot of shady stuff because you got two of the biggest bullies in the NBA today. Two of the biggest bullies in the NBA today. I don't think they're going to give Golden State a run for their money just yet because of that Boogie Cousins. Oh, my God. I can't wait to make that video. Because of that Boogie's Cousins uh, signing. And for him to sign a minimum contract just to get on that squad was just ridiculous. But we'll see how this, this season turns out, man. I wish the best of luck to both teams. I wish the, definitely wish the best of luck to the Lakers, man. I want to see these guys definitely strive. And if they could win a chip, man, by all means. But go for that Kawhi. Go for that Kawhi Leonard trade. If they can get that trade done, it is a wrap. All right, NBA will be a very interesting season. I think LeBron should have signed to Houston because they have the pieces and they lost Trevor Ariza, so it would have been a good signing for LeBron to go there. But, hey, it is what it is, all right? He has, I guess, you know, his family takes into account, family and everything like that. 
probably talked to Magic and told him who he wanted. And look, he got he got who he wanted. Rajon Rondo. You know, it's a it's a grand scheme of things. Um, I the GM man, the GM. <laughs> shout out to Magic man. Shout out to everybody that that made this possible. Uh, we're gonna definitely take it on, man. We're gonna have fun. Um, the next couple videos because we will have some more videos coming out very very soon if you haven't already man drop that like hit that subscribe button i appreciate the love appreciate the support excuse any noise that you did hear in the background i am in a new location now we have moved uh back to the states so we'll be here for a little while we got a lot of videos coming out folks a lot of video coming out definitely drop that like show your boy some support Drop that subscribe, man, if you're into sports, because we definitely going to be covering some sports now that we're back in the States and we got that good Wi-Fi. All right? I love you all. I love you all, man. It's your boy, Wizzy. I'm out. Peace.